what's up guys so it's the weekend and i'm super duper duper excited because um i don't know i just I, i'm excited i gotta finish my hair um so you guys don't mind the mess i gotta like clean my room today um that is on the list so i was gonna film a day in the life of vlog um and really it's gonna be more like a weekend in the life of because i have a ton of things to do um but i got a shower I gotta do my hair which you guys will see that in a whole nother video like I'm gonna show you guys me doing my hair in another video and what else do I have to do I gotta make some keychains for some customers then I gotta work on some digital stuff for my planner business um I gotta clean up and I want to organize um all of my hobbies because I have a lot of them and they're all kind of like starting to crowd in on me so I want to get everything organized and I have an idea for how I want to do that but I gotta go to Walmart and get a shelf. So, I don't know. I think I'm gonna go start with the shower and then we'll come back and do everything else. What up guys? So right now I'm actually working on some stuff for my digital planner shop. I tend to get a little bit more creative at night. Um, that's when I really find myself like doing the most. Um, so right now I'm actually working on a planner that I wanted to actually have in my shop last week but I ended up when I put it in good notes to test it out I which I really just go through put it in good notes so my process is I create something I throw it into good notes I test the links out to make sure everything looks right um and then I upload it straight to Etsy um so when I threw it in good notes I noticed that one of the links in the planner was broken which I should have known because the the template that I used has a broken link in it and instead of think, going back and fixing it before I did all of this I'm now in the process of doing it so dumb on my own part but whatever so typically I will work on a project it only takes me I would say like a day maybe it may it sometimes a little longer if I have interruptions um but normally like a one solid day of work could probably generate a planner um undated if i'm gonna do a dated planner it would probably be a little bit longer um just because you got to go in and key all the numbers in and i'm kind of uh neurotic about the numbers like i i like for them to all be like i don't know even in space and it's just it's enough to drive you insane so like my most popular planner the erin Condren, the original that i posted it took me i think three days over Christmas break to put that planner together um so yeah right now I'm just key I'm just fixing links in this planner and then I'm going to um put it back in good notes test it out and if it looks good then I'm going to um take some screenshots from good notes and put them in pick monkey that's what I used to create all of my store thumbnails and now I have gotten to the point where I use my store thumbnails for what I post on my Instagram as well and I'm trying to like continue to be continue to keep doing it but it's really hard I'm gonna work while I'm talking to you guys um it's really hard to be focused on one job because I have I don't know like I'm working full-time I'm running this digital planner shop and I want to keep giving you guys good content um in addition to that I'm also starting another business where I'm making um, acrylic keychains and selling other stuff too but um the biggest thing that I've started with was the acrylic keychain so it's kind of just like am I biting off more than I can chew like sometimes I think that and then I'm just like nah I'm all right so I don't know if I crash and burn you guys just come save me because that's that's what I'm doing all right so As long as you're there, as 
long as you're there about to do my toes and then I'm gonna work on the back of my head because that needs to happen tonight like I'm so done y'all you want to know when I started these extensions just guess just guess Friday okay guess what day it is Friday so I've had a whole week with these extensions in not completed and honestly I'm not even I should be ashamed of myself but I've done this before, so we're gonna, um, I really, I knew, I knew I wasn't gonna put them all in at the same time, but it's fine, it's whatever. Um, I can take these off, because I'm not working on the computer anymore. Alright, so, I'm getting ready to change my nail color, so actually, or, I already took the other color off, and I've done my base coat and my first coat of this color. It is called Bubble Bath, and I actually got this from my beauty supply store, it's like, you guys probably can't see it but it's like a really really light pink color and I'm going to hit my second coat and hopefully I don't need a third because then it starts to look like really I don't know like weird so I'm just gonna paint my toes so that tomorrow they don't look rough Yes, to Misha's house. Yeah, and what's up, guys? We're going to Greenville, France, and... Where are we going? We're going to Greenville. We are. Okay, let's go. All right, let's go. We're here. You excited? Yeah! He's excited. All right, let's go see Misha. Huh? Oh, she, um, she got slime. She got slime. Yeah, and they and they gonna pinch themselves, and they not wearing green. Cause they not wearing green. No. Okay, can you hold my camera? You wanna hold it? Okay. What's up, guys? Outside. Miles, you're way too close to the camera. Pet. Yeah. Pet, pet. Are you excited? I am excited. Are you excited? Yeah. What's up guys? Okay, so I'm just gonna end this vlog here. We just got back from VA. We did some shopping for my god sister's um, senior portraits are this week and so she wanted to go pick up some outfits and I just happened to, she wanted me to like give her some ideas and some tips. So I went with her um, and I actually have like a haul for you guys. So if you're interested in that part, I'm just gonna kind of run through Oh, what I bought which this is the first time I've been shopping out pretty much like since corona started uh, and it's definitely different like wearing a mask and everything but oh my god I miss shopping so I got this from Target it is the NYX can you see it 
Um, it's the NYX Dip Shape and Go. Um, which I don't know if this is new or I just haven't seen it before. But it's basically supposed to be like a pomade and a brow pencil, I'm assuming, in one. And I really like um, my brow pomade that I got from L'Oreal. But this was like a limited edition. A, this was a limited edition version. So I really wanted to, um, sorry, I'm like breaking all the way out. So right after this video, I'm going to do a mask. Um, but I really like this product here but I got it on clearance so obviously it's not there anymore so I'm hoping that this will be a really good dupe for it but it was like 10 bucks so I'm really hoping that I like it the next store we went to was Olive Olay um and I got two things from there I just got this pink bodycon dress and it's just like super sorry I just got this pink bodycon dress so I love dresses like this um I'm very small very petite I guess you could say and so for me like finding clothes that fit really well is a struggle so typically I just stick with like bodycon dresses because they're just flattering on me um the other thing I got were just these earrings and they're just like some basic cubic zirconia earrings because I lose mine all the time and I'll leave them in my like I'll leave them in and then I'll just take them out when I wash my hair or something and I'll lose them. So I got those. Um, I got two t-shirts. The next place I went was H&M. And actually I'm going backwards, but it's fine. So, so the next place I went was H&M. And I got two of these like boxy crop t-shirts. Because I was in Forever 21. And I got one in white and then I got one in like this like khaki color I guess and it's just like a boxy gray t-shirt and I was in Forever 21 and I happened to like when I after I had checked out um they had I noticed a t-shirt that was like boxy and cropped and that's kind of like what I like wearing when I'm around the house like if you can see this shirt it's very it's like cropped and it's very boxy so it's very loose very fit lowy that's just what I like when I'm at home um then I got this uh sweatshirt and it just says love and the shirts were sorry so the dress was on clearance for like six dollars and then these shirts were six dollars so 5.99 each and i got them each in a small then i got this uh sweatshirt and it was 9.99 and i got this in a medium because i like my sweaters to be a little oversized um i got these dress pants well they're actually uh trouser pants and i got them in a two i'm hoping they fit normally i'm a zero so but i do like the like flowy look so i'm hoping that these will look really cute for work um and also for some instagram pictures <laughs> um next i got a oh the trousers were ten dollars then i got this plain tank top and i think it's cropped uh this i got at the assistance of my god sister she was just like you should get one too so i was like okay so yeah i got that and then the last one was a clearance item and it's just a pink medium size sweatshirt and it was four dollars and it has uh the word glowing up here on the corner so that's all i got from h&m the big one <laughs> Forever 21. So I love Forever 21. I think that they have some great pieces. Like if you are constantly changing your style, Forever 21 is probably the store for you just because like some of their stuff is really good quality and some of it's kind of like, eh, like, you know, you wash it a couple of times and it goes the way it was. So I like it. I went to like almost everything I got was on the clearance section, but yeah. So I got this just a plain pink t-shirt just because I really, like, if you see my drawer of t-shirts, everything is black. So, I was trying to, like, introduce some color into my life. So, I got that. And apparently, I went on a pink kick today. So, I also got this shirt here. And it's just got, like, these little eyelash details on it. Um, and this was, I got, it was $5 in blush. And it's the woven top cami. I got it in a small. And I'm hoping that I can wear this, like, with a cardigan um, and some dress pants to work. Um, next is, this was a dress that was on clearance for, like, three bucks. And I was super excited. Um, so this was a small, and it's three dollars. And it is, um, like, a wrap type dress. And then it's kind of flowy at the bottom, which I love these kind of dresses. I find that they are also very flattering because I have a like a very a small waist um and so kind of like it fits and flares and those types look really flattering on me so I try to pick up anything I can get in that style 
All right, next I got this shirt here. These clothes are warm because I left them sitting in the car for a while today. Um, and this is just, I don't even know, but it was $5. And I was just like, you know what? Um, like the fabric is really good for good material for work. So that was why I got that. I can't believe I bought all this pink. All right, so I'm really into cheetah print. Don't judge me. Um, but I got this shirt for pretty much like wearing around the house. Just kind of like a... You know, just wearing it here at home. Not that I plan to wear that out in public very much, but I got it. Um, then I got this shirt here. And it's just like an oversized striped shirt. And this is actually a small. So I'm assuming it's supposed to fit like super oversized. Um, I didn't try any of this on. So if I regret it, like, y'all. Y'all. Um, but yeah, it's just an oversized black and white striped top. Um, and then I got a, another pink item, surprise, surprise, um, and it is a bodysuit that is super cute, so it looks like this, as you can see, it's a bodysuit, and I think this will be really cute, um, like, just off the shoulders, um, with, like, some black trouser pants. Alright, another dress shirt that I got, and I wonder if she did not ring, she might not have ring this up like she was supposed to, um, so I got this shirt here. And it was originally $18. It was supposed to be 50% off, but the girl who rung me apparently didn't know that everything wasn't ringing, and I was not paying attention well enough to check, so I probably got scammed on this stuff, but it's, it is what it is. Alright, so this shirt here, um, and it's just like a white with a floral detailing pattern, detail pattern in it. So super cute. I thought, again, black dress pants, because that's pretty much what I live in at work. Alright, so then the next thing is just another white uh, flowy shirt. This one is kind of a little more, like the material is more dressy. So I could probably get away with wearing this to work um, or church, something like that. Next is the same type of shirt, but this time in like a mauve color, apparently. So again, kind of oversized. I really, like I kind of bounce between like oversized stuff or fitted clothes but that's pretty much where i stay at just like between the two like oh you know i want this or i want that all right next is another a lot of their stuff was at forever 21 contemporary um like a lot of the stuff that i picked up for dress for work and so this is just like a basic black top and it's got the mock neck up here and then on the back it has a tie at the back uh neck so you can, it's kind of sheer, so I have to wear a tank top under it, but it's definitely cute, and it was only $3. Alright, so next, another $3 item, and it was just this cute sweater. Um, I don't know if this is supposed to be a cropped sweater or not. I feel like it's going to be slightly cropped. Um, not like way up here, but just kind of like slight, showing a little bit of waist, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Again, I didn't try any of this on. I probably should have, but I did not. Alright, next is another dressy shirt. This is like a PG color, and I got it in a small, and I'm just going to use this for work purposes. <sighs> Moving on, another black dress shirt. And this just has like a v-neck in it right here. Again, another Forever 21 Contemporary. Um, and it's just black. And it's got a, this little detail here. So it's kind of like a keyhole, I guess. And what's crazy is I actually saw this shirt, um, or one very similar to it, on the Shein website. And I wanted to get it in, like, every color. But I didn't because um, I thought that was being excessive. However, if that one fits right, I may go back and get them. And just, you know, be excessive. It's just going to be what it's going to be. Alright, and then I also got this long sleeve shirt. And it's just kind of, like, over... Um, it's really thin and lightweight. Um, it's got a keyhole in the back, and this is a small, so it does fit a little oversized, I believe. And this was also $3, so yeah, there's that. Um, and then this last piece, or last shirt item, is this one here. And really, I just got this because it was one on sale and also because I have like a bunch of outfits on Pinterest saved and in a lot of them the girl is wearing like a striped white shirt and I just couldn't find one that I liked 
Um, and then I did have one that I got from Old Navy a long time ago, but it was long sleeve, so it wouldn't really fit. So I got that one. And I just got like some random socks, like some duck print socks, some kiwis and hearts socks, and then some cherries. And I like these socks because uh, in our house, like nobody ever has socks. They all seem to go missing. And I feel like I'm the only one that ever buys socks. So when I get socks that are like funky patterned, like I keep track of them better because it's like, okay, I know those are my socks. Whereas with like black socks, it's always like, oh, I'm missing black socks too. I'm missing black socks too. Like everybody's missing black socks. So I got those and then I got some jewelry. So I got this necklace here. Um, and then I got this one because I've seen like a lot of little stores, um, like little boutiques online selling jewelry like this. And most of them, like, you get your, uh, like, your year of birth or something, or your, um, zodiac sign. And so this one just says Bonita. So I got this just because I like the style of it. And then I got a leopard print headband because I'm obsessed with leopard print. And the last thing I got were these glasses because I told my brother they give me, um, her vibes, you guys can see my ring light in the back. Um, the singer, they give me like those vibes. So I got them and he got a pair that are similar to them. So yeah, but that is everything that I got. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I have had a lot of fun filming it for you guys. So if you want more day in the life, weekend in the life vlogs, just comment down below, like this video and I will see you guys next time.